Of course, in Europe, uh, we do have a sort of, uh, we do measure our carbon emissions and we continue to try to bring it down. If you were to drill down to the basics of a, an energy cost to get something from A to B, whether that's even on the sort of agenda, um, because, I mean, I work in the, in the dry bulk shipping uh, market, so for us, a sort of dollar per tonne per mile basis, we are incredibly cheap and very efficient. Is that, is that sort of um, framework even something on the agenda for like, in terms of sustainability and carbon footprint of the entire transport journey? I don't have much to say because um, <laughs> we, this part of the region, uh, I must admit that we don't do much on this area, but, uh, but we try to do whatever is possible within our control, for example, the buildings, uh, make sure that the building is uh, energy efficient using solar panels uh, wherever it's possible. And also we uh, try to make sure that um, the vendors in trucking, are, uh, we don't have our own trucks, we make sure that uh, they are uh, uh, maintaining the trucks uh, efficiently. And then, uh, of course, in Europe, uh, we do have a sort of, uh, we do measure our carbon emissions and we continue to try to bring it down. Uh, but I think uh, as an organization, I think it definitely uh, it's on the agenda for us. And uh, in, this, in this region, uh, like Peter said, it's, uh, it's early days for us. But we have to catch up, and then I think it's, it's, it is on our agenda of what best we can do uh, to support and uh, to support this cause. At this point, I would say for us, it's early days.